<laughs> I remember when we first arrived in London. Wow, look at that truck! <laughs> Brick Lane was one of the first places that uh, we, we went to. I mean, I was brought up in London, but when I returned, when I was older, um, yeah, so fascinated by the atmosphere and, 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 and the people. And, and Spitzfields Market was just the, you know, um, just so wonderful. And we started s selling stuff that we found from the car boot sales at Spitzfields Market on a, on a Thursday. We used to live in a little flat on Raymond Road and, and drag our bags and stuff down Brick Lane towards Spitzfields Market when we first started. But as 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 every other market trader would know, that stuff accumulates really quickly, and um, eventually we weren't able to drag our stuff anymore. We had to pay up for some storage space. Um, and I learned that this was the square that Jack the Ripper <laughs> It was just, it was so thrilling to know that we, I was in the heart, living in the heart of the East End. Every Thursday morning there'd be a, 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 a hover, a tram sat outside one of the nice, nice houses with a mug of tea. <laughs> it was sweet, it was sweet. But there was such a, there's such a strong sense of the community in the and uh, I think the centre point is there. Uh, it's Richfield's Market. It used to take us like two hours in the morning to set up and then at the end of the day. Hello, how's it going? Yeah, very <laughs> good. Sit there for a coffee. We take it in turns to go and keep warm, keep our feet warm in the winter. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> They're the best neighbours at Girl Kid Arsenal. She knows how to shake that thing! Oh, mess around. I declare she can mess around. Hey, 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 h